Well, Sharice, the Department of Environmental Services is urging people to use common sense and stay out of the water in any area where there's a posted advisory. DES is seeing an increase of dangerous levels of cyanobacteria this summer. Officials say the bacteria is always in lakes and ponds, but usually at safe levels. It's unclear what causes the spike. Through a variety of factors, uh, it can cause a bloom if it's uh, if the water looks you know scummy or you know there's really blue green in the water. You know we recommend you just stay out of the water. The most recent advisories include French and Kaiser Ponds in Henniker, Sebbins Pond in Bedford, and Lee's Pond in Moultonboro. Short-term health effects of being exposed include skin irritation. The problem with cyanotoxins is they could be uh, a serious issue over the long term. You know, there's problems with kidney, liver, or your central nervous uh, system function. A safety warning is posted at Opeechee Park Cove Beach on Lake Winnipesaukee in Laconia, where high levels of fecal bacteria were recently discovered. DES says it's important to know the warning doesn't include the entire lake, just that specific area. In areas where there's a spike in cyanobacteria, DES urges people to keep their dogs out of the water in the posted advisory areas as the toxins could be deadly to pets. And the dog may enter into the water and that can be a problem because then the dog will then sort of lick themselves clean and then expose themselves to those cyanotoxins. And DES urges anyone who may notice signs of cyanobacteria to contact them so they can perform tests. Live in studio, Siobhan Lopez, WMUR News 9.